Well, good morning, everybody. Linda Ray, Texas Girls Farm. And the boys have showed up. Yes, I got lots of sick chicken. I don't know if a girl's going to take it, uh, make it. I'll take y'all. I moved her into the trailer where it was warmer. But I wanted to show y'all uh, where they're at. And we walked around and laid out all the doors and the windows. And as you can see, and they're in the process of getting the one whole back wall framed up so I'm not gonna get in their way and gonna let them work and uh, I'll bring back y'all later well the guys have broke for lunch <clears throat> and I figured I'd come out here <clears throat> it's a little chilly this morning it's about lunchtime now. It broke for lunch. <clears throat> so I thought I'd come out here and um, show y'all what they've got done so far. So as you can see, there's the uh, mudroom slash bathroom. Um, there's the back wall of the bedroom. There's the back closet. And here they're framing for um, this other bathroom. And... Um, They've got that header in for the window there, the windows in, in the bedroom. They've marked off everything where um, the uh, interior walls are going to go. And it was interesting. Um, I asked them a question because if I'll show you all how they've um, notched out all of these boards to put um i think he said they're gonna put one befores through and that's all uh, i guess uh cross framing so they can um have something to put the metal on so gives you an idea of how everything's going to be uh the door's going to be right here um, the window over here and frame this so hopefully it's going to be you know close but um, this way we can tell exactly how much room we're going to have for the washer and dryer may have to stack them which will be fine but um, it makes it so much different to look and we changed up and we're going to put the window over um, a small window over um, where the commode is going to be there but um, here's this door that, to be uh, framed out so um, it's cold out here the, w the wind is blowing and um, it was raining a little bit this morning but they're doing it the, everywhere there's going to have to be metal they're doing that so y'all can kind of tell um, if you back up just how high um, the upstairs is going to be and um, I'm going to get them to frame up to this point up in there um, and I figured it'd be 8 by 10 for storage room and then if they bring I'm thinking they're going to bring so this is the wall this should be a little a window here and this is where I have a desk in the back wall of the kitchen. And <clears throat> I'm thinking they're going to have to bring, because there's going to be a door there. So I'm wondering if they're going to bring the platform out um, over here for the steps to go up to. And then uh, the bedroom and loft up there. And then it'll stay vaulted um, in the middle section. So... Yeah, um, it's chilly, <clears throat> but um, they're getting it all, getting it all done. <clears throat> and then, of course, I come out and the chickens got to come out and see what's going on. And uh, I've been staying in, staying warm. I don't want to get sick again, but uh, yeah, that's what they're doing. That is what they're doing. And I was really surprised 
<clears throat> on the framing because I thought they were going to run them. Um, I thought they were going to be two by sixes back here and over there because of that, but they didn't have to do that. So it's coming together. Um, I'll come back. <laughs> I'll come back after a while <clears throat> when they finish um, framing for the day. Because I guess they just left to get some lunch. And I'm uh, sure y'all how far they got. My sister, I think, is going to come. And look, I mean, it makes it more spacious when you actually have the walls up. Because, like, there will be a door here. And that will be my whole bedroom. And there will be a door here and a door there. That for the closet. This for to go into the bathroom. And it's just going to be the barn style shaped door so all right i'm gonna get back inside where it's warm and um i see dutton has uh, been successful in getting over there uh with grace which is fine i was gonna go and turn him out anyway but since he's done squeeze through the gate that's fine too so i'll come back later um and let y'all know and see what they've got done today. I'm getting inside. I don't know why it's so cold today. I didn't think it was supposed to be this chilly. So, and still working on our chicken. You guys stay close. Don't be going to run off. Chee, 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 Chicken. Don't go run off. All right. See y'all in a little bit. Well, the boys just left. I can, went and got my wagon and, um, Put all their little um, scraps of wood and was picking up their trash and we are keeping all the bigger stuff that they may be able to use over here but I figured I, I got out here I said I just figured I'd get out here and help y'all I said find something to do I'd actually went and um, doctored um, one of the chickens down there and then let Dutton and mom out because Dutton had broke out and was already over there. And, um, yeah, Dutton t tore the tarp down, the green tarp down, right, or, and then tore one of the solar lights, not the one that goes in to um, the chicken's little coop, thank goodness, tore it down. Anyway, the boys are gone for today. The they asked if I mind if they came back and work tomorrow. And I said, I didn't mind at all. They could do what they wanted to. And this is, this is what we've got so far. So you can see they've got all the face plates down. I guess that's what you call them. Um, for the big walls. And got the bedroom frame, the bathroom, washroom, framed over there there and got the closet and uh, we sat and we talked about all the doors and then we talked about the size of the window here so um, yeah we, we got that all um, measured because um, I think I originally put a 24 by 24 inch window here and we decided to go a little bit bigger, so I need to make sure that Shane gets that information. This window is going to be um, 24 by 48, I believe. 24 by 48. This one is going to go here over the commode. 24 by 24. The other one that's going to go over that. Uh, commode is 24 by 24 and yeah I should have plenty enough room may rethink it and make this uh, corner shower instead of coming all the way back out here just to have more room for uh, washer and dryer or I could stack them I haven't decided I may go to stacking them but I really I mean, I don't mind it. I've had it like that before, but um, I just have to think about it, how I want that done. And then my, uh, this would be uh, my bedroom. There's my little nook there so I can put my computer desk and my computer and have a window. 
these are going to be i think 36 by 36 inch windows on each side of the bed and yeah Brooke and everybody was saying how small this room was going to be but it's actually um pretty decent size i mean my bed and my desk and my armoire everything should fit in here perfectly because my bed's probably only about right here so yeah i should have plenty of room and then um this is going to be the closet which that's a plenty of room in there for that because i'll probably um frame on this wall the shelves and stuff and yeah and then um this bathroom and it's funny because this bathroom actually because of the layout looks bigger than the other one but they're actually the same size yeah so and the shower will be here and we may have to since this frame so close well, it's going to be a barn door, so I guess we could frame here for the back of the shower. And that'd be plenty enough shower room. That's, that's what I'm thinking. Yeah, plenty of room. So, we talked about, um, we talked about there's going to be a platform that comes up all the way out here to this side. It goes up there to to the loft and I at first thought the platform was going to come all the way out here but uh, we re-communicated and it's going to go up over so the door can open up all the way and then there will be a closet built in some back back here under the steps and then um, I have to knock that room back down to like I think we said a, a 9 by 10 close to a 9 by 10, maybe a little bit bigger than 9 by 10, like 9 foot 4 inches uh, by 10, and then this loft, and then what he's going to uh, do here is come out and frame like a fake something over here, because I'm going to just have floating shelves, so I'm not going to have cabinets, and I told him I wanted to use some of the can lights, so he said he, he could uh, frame something out where we can just drop lights in and have lights coming down, and that way I don't have to worry about my, my lighting in here since all of this is all going to be open, so I'll step back and try to get y'all a, a full view of everything that's been done today and just the I mean I couldn't ask for better people working on a job I, I've seen uh, framers and stuff where the framers just come and work they don't have any personalities or anything like that this group um, a good group of young men and very happy been ha very happy with everybody that has been up here to do any work on this build so uh, there we go and tomorrow um, maybe they'll have this, these outside, uh, walls done. So, yeah, we'll see how it goes, but, um, chicken inside the house, she's still making it, but, um, not doing real, real good. I mixed her a solution of some sugar water and then some egg yolk and then been, um, feeding her with, a. Uh, a syringe just to get some make sure she is hydrated and get some nutrients and trying to not kill her myself but wanted to bring y'all the overall shot of the building and how it's all come along and I'll make sure tomorrow that I do a video for y'all and show y'all what they get accomplished um, tomorrow so the framing on the exterior walls for living is going to go all the way up so that's going to be some massive work there and i don't know how much um, they're going to get done but um junior's been afraid of the nail guns so he's been in the trailer most of the day it's just now really warmed up i mean it warmed up i guess about an hour and a half two hours ago when i came out because it was too cold um earlier at lunch 
and I went back in and uh, but it's not quite feeding time <laughs> and the roosters are ever which direction that they're not supposed to be those are trying to figure out how to get out but I've got Dutton and mom out there in the, the pasture well and Miss Maggie made her some more friends today and she was already carrying some of the blocks of wood off so I told him don't leave no none laying that you might need because she's going to pick them up and take them but with that said if you like the content <laughs> hit that thumbs up button now if you haven't subscribed come on over and subscribe and hit that notification bell so every time we upload a video you'll be notified and um, yeah the adventure continues and I hope y'all are enjoying your weekend and we'll catch y'all on the next one look at them crazy dogs just playing